What's going on, YouTube? This is your boy, Mom901. This is 901 Elevation TV. Here we elevate. And today's episode is, Are You Chosen? So, um, what I mean by chosen, are you different? Are you the one that don't fit in? This video might be for you. You know what I'm saying? It might help you out and uh, understand yourself a little better. But, um... I got eight things down here for y'all don't know me. Um, I write my notes down. You know, if I don't look at the camera, I'm looking down at my notes. I write my stuff down, and then I, uh, if I can dish it out to y'all properly. So, um, we're going to jump right into it. The first thing is, well, the, how I started, how I knew I was different was um, it started off as a child. So, uh, yo... Your life, um, how you living right now, currently, uh, it reflects from when you was a child. And um, why I say that is because of, um, like, a lot of us say we grew up in poverty and stuff like that. Like, we grew up in, a, like, a neighborhood that's kind of wild and stuff like that. Or if you grew up around uh, in a nice neighborhood, you know, you tend to act like that when you get older. Like, you... You like fit in wherever you went. So, um, me on the other hand, I grew up in poverty and, um, uh, like my family was not like, they weren't, they not the best and, uh, like they weren't the best financially. Like, so, uh, I grew up in poverty and stuff like this, so they weren't the best financially. But, I, they was kind of like, to me, they was kind of like disabled, but not disabled, like, like, uh, like you gotta have a check or something like that, but like, they just went, they did what they could or whatever, but we managed, we made it, but they went, they wasn't, I'm just gonna say they went financially and stuff like, like, they wasn't the best like that, you know what I'm saying, like, could have been better. Honestly, keeping it real. But we all got flaws. We all deal with stuff. But back to what I was saying is um, my position, why I always feel like as a child, honestly, was like um, I always knew deep down inside I, I, I'm the one that's going to, I'm the one that's keeping you know, like, I'm the one that's supposed to, like, be, like, the key, the chain, like, the missing link or something like that. Like, to keep the family together and, like, uh, get them to work together and stuff like that. But, like, I never, I never knew how, you know what I'm saying? I was a child, so I'm like, oh, you talking, like, like, five, you know, like, four, five, six. When your senses start really just uh, kicking in with you, like you 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 understanding now, and I knew I was the one that like keep the family together, but I I just didn't know how. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, why me? I'm questioning myself at this point. I'm like, why me? Why would I feel like that? You know, like I don't know, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Can I do something like that? I'm questioning myself, but uh, look at me now. I am now. I'm all about working together. I'm all about uh, communicating with my family, uh, keeping the tight bond, keeping the close bond. If we, if I didn't, like, when you see this video, and if I don't talk to you, like, if I didn't talk to you when I was younger and stuff like that, you know, everything happened for a reason. It probably wasn't meant for me to be around you when I was younger. You know what I'm saying? I can communicate with you now, now that I'm older and I understand more, and you understand more. We got more understanding. We can... Um, you know, communicate better now. So, uh, like, like I said, like I'm the one, like I'm, like I'm big on it. Like I feel like we need to work together. You know what I'm saying? Especially what's going on right now. You need to work together. This, you know, you're stronger together than you are apart. So, uh, like I said, I feel like it's something that started when you was a child, and. Um, you always feel like you're supposed to be somebody. Now, like, your story don't have to be like like mine's. Like, I feel like I'm supposed to keep the family together. It could be anything. You, you feel like you're supposed to be a famous superstar or something like that. Like, I, I felt that too. Like, 
when I was young, I'm like, man, I got like a superstar uh, reality, like uh, personality and the way I am and stuff like that. Like I'm wild, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm not shy type person or nothing like that. So I'm like, man, I got like a superstar like uh, personality. Like I supposed to like be, you know, big. Like like I'm supposed to be like dying, you know what I'm saying? Like look at, like yeah, I'm I'm that here. So, uh, but my life didn't go like that exactly, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not saying that I won't reach that point. I'm just saying that currently, like, I'm going through stages right now of, uh, like, me being doing what I'm doing now, coaching y'all, uh, helping people, um, reaching out to people. As long as I touch a couple people, I'm good, but I'm aiming to touch more than just a couple people, you know what I'm saying? It's to the top of me. So, uh... Like I said, you always feel like you're supposed to be somebody. No, maybe it's a rapper, singer, a doctor, whatever. Like, you always feel like you're supposed to be somebody special. Like, you don't supposed to be a nobody. You know what I'm saying? They, they you a chosen person. You're different. So, um, the second thing that I got is, um, you, you would feel different at your job. You know what I'm saying? Like, the job that you work and stuff like that, like, I know from, from my point of view, all the jobs that I work, uh, can't no manager say nothing bad about me, like, far as me, uh, getting my work done or something like that. Like, I'm a great worker. I'm a, uh, I know how to work great with people. I make, uh, I, like, I just, I light make day up, all kind of stuff. Like, I even make them joke. I even had them joking, you know, because I'm an outspoken person and I'm not, like, I'm not a shy person. For the people that know me, I'm not a shy person. Like, y'all know, like, he always been the type that make me feel good, even if I'm feeling down. So, uh, like I said, you will bump heads with your, uh, at work, like with your manager, or if you call them boss, I, me personally, I don't call them boss. I never did call nobody boss. You ain't the boss of me. It's like me calling you my dad. No, you're not my boss. You just, uh, you just a manager. You just manage me. It's cool. Keep Keep right there. I just don't like that word. I don't like to call you that word, boss. So, uh, but that's the boss in me, though. That's why. But, um, and if somebody else out there like that, they're just the boss in you. You don't, you don't like the word to call somebody else boss. You know what I'm saying? Like, nah, you, you just a manager, you know? It's just the dude in front of me, you know, or the woman in front of me. You ain't my boss. You, I, I feel crazy. If I even hear a, 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 a person older than me talking about, I got to talk to my boss. My boss going to be on me. Bro, that's why you in a situation you in. You been here how long? No, sir. No, man. I'm good. But... That's why you bump heads with them because of you're chosen. You're you're a different being. You're a different. You you like like you you supposed to be greater than it. Like you you not in a position that you supposed to be in in your life. Like you not. That's not where you landed. Like if you feel like you bumping heads with it, every job and and mountains and stuff like that, yo and, and your job too easy to you and it just get to the point where you like, man, I'm sick of this shit. Like I. I just want to quit. If I didn't have all these bills and shit like that, I'll fucking quit. But the reason being is because you different. You you like you you chose and you supposed to be doing something else. You need to find your goals. I help you with all that. Go watch some of my older videos. You know, they help you uh on how to find your life purpose purpose and stuff like that. That ain't what you supposed to be doing. You know what I'm saying? Focus on something else, find you something else to do. Um Number three is um, people act different around you. You know um, that you know how these per how this person act when they get around you, and they got some folks, other people around you, like around. They get to act a little different, stuff like they try to act like, oh shit, he go such such. They be quiet a little bit. They you know for that crazy, you know who they be on the other stuff. You know, and people do me like that because I don't believe in what they believe in and stuff like that. And, like, I can talk from both ends because I have believed in what you believed in. I was once felt like I was Christian, you know what I'm saying? Until I learned better and I, you know, I got more knowledge. 
So now I don't do those things. So now I'm, I'm just um, I'm I'm just a spiritual being having a human experience, and you are too. You just got to uh, put more knowledge on yourself. Like you don't you don't learn anything. You like you just got that um, religion and. You don't know nothing about it, really. Like you just, you just take it and it's like, okay, cool. That's why you go through a lot of stuff that you go through, just because you, you don't, you don't even try to learn nothing new, you know, because you, you, you just think it's wrong, but wrong might get you to the right place. Have you ever thought like that? All right. Um, like I said, people act different around you, but those same people that you. The same people that act different around you, you brighten their day for them. You know what I'm saying? You 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 brighten their day. Like I said, I brighten people day all the fucking time. Like I brighten folks day all the time. Like they can be feeling sad. They people like when I come through the door, like I'm already a celebrity. Like it, when I be at job, it be like I'm a celebrity already. Cause they already know me. Like they know me, they know my voice, they know I'm, they know how I'm coming. Like they know me. Like for the people that know me, like they already know. Like Marvin, I only go my boy. My, I know he finna have me trip. They finna be good now. You know what I'm saying? Say the day, but um, not not to brag or nothing like that. But you know, the people that know me, you see this video. But, um, like I said, you brighten people day. And you doing that, you brighten, you find yourself brightening people day. They come and tell you, like, man, you be brighten my day. You just don't know. I was so damn sad before you came up. You, you made my day, like, for real. And, like, you a chosen person. Like, you different. Like, you not like the rest of them. So, um, another thing is, um, when you come around people, you're going to bring luck to them. Like, your luck, like, like they have good luck because they just around you. You know what I'm saying? They around your presence, your energy. Like, your energy, you just got a certain energy about you. Like, you got great energy. Like, down, like, down, not, like, they don't even know they, like, some of them probably do know, like, they, like, I ain't trying to come around him or her. That just great stuff be happening to me. Like, I was damn bad before I got around you. Like, now I got around you, I'm just, I'm living it up. You know what I'm saying? Because I gave you some of my energy. You know what I'm saying? I've been through this. Like, this is from experience. I'm not telling you nothing that's not from experience. This is from experience. I've done this with multiple people, especially uh, after I learned who I am and what the kind of power that I possess. Um... I didn't help multiple people out, you know what I'm saying? And, and like, even by me talking to you, reaching out to you, great stuff happened to you, you know what I'm saying? Because I, I reach out and, and touch you and give you some energy, give you great energy, you know what I'm saying? You just been feeling down bad or whatever, I'm, I help you out. This is what I do, you know what I'm saying? I love you. But um, you chosen if you find yourself doing something like that. You chosen. Um... The fourth thing is, um, um, people don't know how to look at you, you know what I'm saying? Because of your energy too, so strong, and you know what I'm saying? They know you special. So, uh, I actually got a friend, and I came around her one day, who was at work, and she was like, man, you be on it. It crazy stuff, my mood, my love, though, my gone, though. You be, you, you, you tripping. You know what I'm saying? I already know you finna come with something crazy. Watch out, like that. But it's like, it's in a good way. But she like, you know, they don't even know how to deal with this stuff because your energy so strong, your presence so strong. Like you, you just give off a certain vibe. You know what I'm saying? You might make them get the chills or something like that because of. The energy that you bring, you know what I'm saying? You're a great person. You got a great aura about yourself. Like, you just, you, a, you got a glow. You got a certain glow on you. And, like, people know that. Certain people know that. You know what I'm saying? But me, truly, honestly, I believe if people know that, that's the um, the greatness in them. You know what I'm saying? Because I, I see, like, if you see something in me, that's, that's uh, 
a similar version of me and you. You know what I'm saying? It's like we share the same thing. You know, you just don't, you just not aware of what's going on right now. It's all you got to catch up. You just got some catch up and some learning to do. But it's cool. Um, that means you chosen though. In other words, that you are chosen. You know, if you if you make people feel like this. If you you got people like, oh man, move, you on the musical stuff, but they love you, you know, they like, ah, oh, I miss you, like, are you too cool? Like, you chosen. You know what I'm saying? You making them feel good. You chose your presence, your aura, they know what's up with you. Um, um, five. They'll try to um downplay your dreams and your goals. You know what I'm saying? They like they they know like they know you see things that the other people don't see. You know what I'm saying? They don't know how to cope with it. You know what I'm saying? They don't know how to handle things like that. They know they know like like you know in like they know and you know that you see like like. Uh, uh, I'm gonna say like a balloon could have flew in the air, but you saw something else. But they didn't see something. You know they ain't see the whole picture. You saw the whole picture. You seem to see the whole picture. They just see what they see in front of them with these two eyes. You see like, okay, what well, if the balloon got bigger as it went in the sky? You know what I'm saying? You might saw something different, something that's not normal. You know what I'm saying? You probably saw something abnormal. And um, that means that you different. You know what I'm saying? You chosen. Like you not. Like you you just not normal. You know what I'm saying? So you a chosen person. Like you don't tend. It's, it's for your eyes only though. That was only for your eyes to see and not theirs. And then you be asking yourself like, how they not see this? How they not see this? Cause I had to. You know, this is real. Like this is honest. Like. I had to ask myself a lot of like I asked myself so many times like how do they not see that trick that these folk playing on them? How they not see it? You know what I'm saying? But you gotta remind yourself they don't see everything like you see it. They not woke. They not. They not alert to certain shit. Like once you go conscious and stuff, it's hard to go back subconscious. Like it's hard to not use your brain on. Like it's like, like I don't, I don't, I don't see, I don't, I don't see how they don't see it, the trick, the, the the trick that they playing. You know what I'm saying? Like you not, you ain't winning, you losing. You don't get it. It's a rat race. You don't even get it. You ain't, you ain't trying to get it either. You know what I'm saying? But some people just comfortable with what they doing, what they got going. So, but like I said, back to the video. You chose it. You know what I'm saying? That's why you see other things that you see stuff that they don't see. And they gonna try to downplay your dreams and your goals, you know, and like like you might tell them you finna start selling clothes. They gonna be like, Man, everybody sell clothes. Man, you ain't gonna make no sales. Man, you ain't gonna make no sales. Ain't nobody gonna buy, no gonna buy that shit. You get what you gonna do with? My nah. My head nah. Don't do it. Don't do it. You gonna waste your money. You know what I'm saying? Somebody gonna somebody gonna steal your shit. You know what I'm saying? Somebody gonna nah, don't do it. You know what I'm saying? But it's cause you chose them. They don't see the picture like you see it. They not gonna see it like you see it. Cause they think they, they already know everything, which is a fixed mindset. So that's a whole other video. They just got a fixed mindset. Just know that if you don't know what a fixed mindset is, look it up. Or I will be dropping a video about a fixed mindset. So a lot of folks can't know about this shit. Like, they need to know it. But you different though. You know, you chosen. You're a chosen person. Like, you chosen to do other big things out here. Um, number six is um, you have a high intelligence. You know, you are already smart. You know, you are already, like, you intelligent anyway, but, you know, people on the other hand, I would, like, I feel like it's best to play, like, if, okay, I'm going to say it like this. If they're going to play slow, sometimes it's good for you to play slow. But when it comes down to um, 
putting knowledge on the head, you know, show them what's going on. You know, let them know what's going on. Let them, let them know what's pop. You know what I'm saying? That way they don't want to approach you like that no more. They want to try to step on your toes. You know what I'm saying? Because you know what I mean? Stepped on their toes. Like, dang, this person, like, I ain't know they was like that. You know what I'm saying? I thought they was dumb. I thought they was slow. You know, nah, everybody ain't slow. They just got good hearts. You know what I'm saying? They just got, they just like, you know, make you feel good. Make you laugh, make you joke. Because you always say, you always dealing with something. You got too many things inside you. You know what I'm saying? You got too many problems, you fight. And that person that joke a lot probably ain't got that many, but a lot of times they probably do got a lot, they just not deal with them better than you do. And they can actually have more demons than you, you know, and they still can uh, deal with their stuff better than you. But um, like I said, they are highly intelligent. You know, you are highly intelligent. Um, you got abilities that others don't have. You know what I'm saying? So what I mean by other abilities is like you probably can play basketball uh, better than any other. Like you probably don't need that much practice. You just cold. You know what I'm saying? You probably cut her good. You just don't need that much practice. You just cold. You do her good. You just cold. It's just natural to you. You know what I'm saying? You different. You chosen to do that. Like. You can talk well. You chosen to do that. You could you could read well. You chosen to do that. You can do math better than anybody that you know. You chosen to do that. Like this, like you psychic. You know what I'm saying? You you find out that you psychic. Me on the other hand, I found that I got abilities. You chosen to do that. You know what I'm saying? You different. You just not the same. And like some people, a lot of people can't even accept it. Because they like, they so big, they so big on your background on how they been knowing you. They think that, oh, he tripping, she tripping. Like, nah, they person ain't tripping, they just understand them. They understand they sell better. So you got to accept it, you know, and it is what it is. But you're different, you chosen. Um, uh, spirits come through you, like they channel through you. You know what I'm saying? Like. Like I said, it might get a little spooky for y'all or whatever. Y'all scared. Yeah. Spirits can come through you, talk th talk through you, communicate through you, you know what I'm saying? And uh, reach out to other people, other loved ones, stuff like that. I do it all the time. My tarot, you know, when I do my readings or whatever, you know, that's how you get your message. You know, that's how we get our message out, you know. But I'm not afraid of you. This is like, when you chosen, you're not afraid of those type of things. Like other people that's not chosen, they scared of stuff like that. They think there's devils or anything like that, you know. But it's mostly religious people, you know. I, I yeah, it's mostly religious people. Like a lot of Christians I know, they they scared of stuff like that. They scared of the truth. They scared of what's going on. They scared of what like it is stuff beyond you. But it beyond what you see with the eyeball. It's still way beyond you. Come on now. You know this. This is why you hear dishes and shit. And you know damn well ain't nothing in there. But your dishes move. Cups and shit move. You might come back in the living room and some shit out there all on the other side of the room. You like, damn, how they do that? But you trying to fight it and be like, nah, that ain't real. Don't be scared. But like I said, Spirit and stuff, they channel through you. You know what I'm saying? This going on with you, congratulations, you chose it. Uh, hmm. Number seven. Um, nah, this is number eight. Nah, yeah, this is number seven, my bad, y'all. They talk to you in, uh, in your mind and give you messages. You know, me on the other hand, I feel like that when you get in the tub or something like that, in the shower, you get a lot of messages. They call some people call them downloads. You know, and this this without books or anything like that. This is just something that might just come to you. You know what I'm saying? You be like, ah, oh, okay. You get those type of moments. Oh, okay. Just out the blue, you chosen. 
you know, like, they just gave you an answer for something that you've been seeking, you know. And, uh, like I said, don't be spooked, just be aware. As long as you're aware, you get chosen. You know what's going on. Uh, number eight is, um, Things are things always go right for you. If thing if things always seem to go right for you, you chose it. You know what I'm saying? Like you feel like, dang, it could have went like this, but man, they always looking out for me. Boy, I'm always I'm lucky. I'm lucky. Dang, I ain't get caught. Or or I got got through with it. Like I just, you know what I mean? Knowing I was wrong, or knowing this, that, 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 and other. You chose it. It wasn't meant for you to get fucked up. Now, we know what's going on. They know what's going on. You chose it. They got you. They protected you. You know what I'm saying? You here for that. So, um, you were chosen. But, uh, those were eight things to, uh, know if you chosen or not. Know if you like you're different, you you different being or whatever. You know you need to find yourself more. You need to uh, hopefully this video helped y'all out. And uh, like I said, if you gained something from this video, like, subscribe, comment. If you watched it all the way through, congratulations, thank you. Uh, um, I appreciate you. Uh, did you get if you got emotionally drained? Thank you for coming. Thank you for seeing me. Thank you for watching me. Um, Hopefully, I, I see you again in the future. You know what I'm saying? I can win you over then. But until then, further notice, uh, like I said, thank you. And um, to the one that stayed, I love you. Thank, thanks for the support. And you will see more content from me, this channel. And uh, we're trying to see this channel grow. We're trying to... I know trying, I know trying to don't grow. We don't grow. We're going to build... And uh, we're going to get we're gonna get to do more topics, you know what I'm saying? More great topics like this. But like I said, this is your boy Mom901. This is 901 Elevation TV. And I'm checking out. Thanks again. Y'all have a great day out there.